a high kick. No one at home, however, for Footscray. And Jim Steins takes an uncontested mark. The big man drifts it back towards O'Dwyer. Tough, I would have thought. Steve Wallace assessed the situation, weighed up the options, realised how much point running back trying to mark it with O'Dwyer bearing down. And I suppose he didn't look at the ball, and O'Dwyer showed a lot of courage. He marked it. Now he's 10 metres out. For his first. And he doesn't miss. Fifth goal on the board for the Demons. Steve O'Dwyer's first and Bulldog fans may consider themselves a little unlucky with that one. Steve Wallace giving away the 50 metre penalty. So for the clever mark, but Melbourne have got the numbers. Stein stood up in the tackle. Brett Lovett, he's got the run of it. Lovett's hand pass is effective. To Peter Rowe, pumps a high kick up towards half forward. And coming over the top was Gary Lyon. Now he's producing his class. Up towards full forward, O'Dwyer, the big long arms out in front. And Steve O'Dwyer will kick for his second goal. He booted one in the first term. And should he get this? The task for the dogs will be that much greater. From 30 metres out, he shoots towards goal and puts it through. So Dwyer gets his second, and it's a case of catch me if you can now for the Bulldogs. Melbourne moved to 13-15, leading Footscray 9-9. And you doubt that they can. John Northey in his sixth season here at Melbourne, when he looks back, I'm sure, would value the contribution throughout those seasons by Gary Lyon and really the difference between these two sides I think is they don't have somebody Footscray to go to like Lyon he's really putting his stamp on this game now just over nine minutes remaining wind got it down but away comes Ford good evasion certainly ran his 15 O'Dwyer <laughs> launched himself from behind didn't juggle it, took it cleanly. He's kicked two goals. He's directly in front, about 25 metres out. It's home. Three goals now to Stephen O'Dwyer. And it's a question of how far Melbourne. 16-18 to Footscray, 10-9. It was promising so much at half-time this game. Seven points the difference Melbourne's way. And that first half saw Footscray end with a flourish. But since half-time, really, they've gone without a whimper, the Bulldogs. And Steve O'Dwyer has proven to be a valuable replacement for Darren Bennett. 